Yo, what's up everyone? Buzzy Beth here. Today, let's learn how to make a part that is moving back and forth. Like the part is literally slamming back and forth. <laughs> so inside of our workspace, let's go ahead and spawn in a part. We're gonna spawn in two parts. So we have this brown part as well as the white part. And our white part is going to be the part that moves. I'm gonna go ahead and rename that white part to moving part cool and then inside of my brown part what i want to do is add a weld constraint now part zero is going to be the part and part one is going to be the moving part so my weld should look a little something like that i'm going to group it all together so that it's in a model i'm going to rotate my model so that it's laying on its side so that if you see where it says uh, origin position, sorry, origin orientation, the Z is a on the 90 degrees, so that, so that it says 90 degrees. Cool. Now, inside of our moving part, let's go ahead and add a script. We have a variable which references the tween service as well as the part itself. I'm going to set the tween info so that it takes 0.5 seconds for my part to move back and forth, the easing style to sign, and the easing direction to in and out. I want this to repeat infinitely, so I'm going to go ahead and just say negative one, and then uh, I do want it to reverse, so I'll set it to true. So for the tween value, I'm going to go ahead and set it so since I do want it to move back and forth on the Z axis, I'm going to go ahead and do math.rad 180 so that our part is literally moving back and forth and back and forth and then set the tween animation so that the tween animation is able to play. Okay, so let's go ahead and hop inside of our game and it looks a little something like this. How funny is that? So obviously I don't like that white part. I don't like seeing it. Um, so what I want to do is actually just go ahead and change the transparency of that part to white. So it looks like this brown part is just moving by itself. Cool. So let's go ahead and hop back inside of our game to see the changes. And we have something that looks like that. So cool. As always, full scripts and models will be posted on our website. Link in the description down below. If you guys enjoyed this content, please give us a like and a subscribe. Have fun creating. I'll catch you guys in the next video. Peace.